not let anyone tell you to stay in your lane or wait your turn. The world moves too fast and changes too suddenly to sit back and wait for things to happen, to go out and make things happen. Good luck, everyone, and I'm rooting for you. Thank you. What is going on guys? Welcome to the video. I just graduated college. That seems surreal. It's pretty surreal. All that time in school. I remember my first day of college, like it was yesterday, I was moving in to my old school and we had, had a bunch of bags with me and it was just four years later and I'm, I'm done. Here's my diploma, Baldwin Wallace University. I don't know. I don't think it's really hit me yet that I'm done with school. Maybe forever. Think I'm done with school for forever? No. no. Probably not. I think I am. I think I want to be. But I don't know. We'll see. Anyways, my friend's coming to take some pictures of me. There's Omar rolling up. Big shout out to my boy Evan McCartney. He just took me some more graduation pictures. I'll throw his Instagram handle on the screen right now and in the description. Anything you need, like LinkedIn headshots or graduation photos or wedding or any type of videography, he's your dude. I'll throw his stuff on the screen. And here's some of the pictures he just took. Alright, today we're at Macaroni Grill celebrating my graduation and Mother's Day. Happy uh, Mother's Day, Mom, and to all the mothers out there. Motherhood is like a, a job that's taken for granted all the time. Motherhood is a full-time job, 24-7, regardless if the, if the kids are young or old, right? You don't stop being a mom just once we grow up. So happy Mother's Day, Mom, and to all the mothers out there. Huge shout out to you. But today we're at Macaroni Grill uh, for my graduation also, and they have the best bread Ever. They already put like this some kind of oil on top and they add an extra oil dip with herbs on it 9.5 out of 10. Today we got the polo caprice with tomatoes and a side salad and whatever this brown stuff is and also a side of buttermilk and mashed potatoes. Alright so here's a classic taste test right here of this pollo caprice. Everywhere I go grilled chicken no negotiations. Juicy, tender, Italian flair. 8.75 out of 10. And then we got mashed potatoes here. Solid, 7.5 out of 10. Alright guys, it is the next morning and I'm headed to the airport, but before I tell you why I'm going to the airport and where I'm going if you don't know already, let me uh, summarize for you my college experience and my insights into just like 30 seconds. So I was a double major, finance and accounting, Bachelor of Arts from Alton Wallace University. I finished with about a 3.8 GPA, good enough for magna cum laude. I played college soccer for three years out of my four years. I was also in uh, the accounting association, I was in the business honor society, I was in the national honor society of college, I think that's what it's called I don't know we don't ever really meet but I was I was part of it I think my main insight to the college experience is that where you end up after your four years or five years however long it takes you assuming you do well is gonna be a lot different than where you originally planned when you first went into school as in the job you accept who you work for the city you live in the people around you the close friends that you still have it's gonna be a lot different probably than when you first went into college and even when you're two or three years done with college once you graduate you're gonna realize that what you expect Expected your life to be like it's probably gonna be a lot different now I'm moving to Atlanta I'm working for one of the big accounting firms I stopped playing soccer and now I'm big into lifting okay that's just a small example of something that ended up totally different than what I thought it would be they're not lying when they say college is the best four years of your life well it's also the quickest four years of your life any opportunity you get to meet someone or sit down with someone or go to a college career fair go do it because who knows where those opportunities could lead you sometime down the line be open be proactive and if you have not graduated yet make sure you take advantage of everything that comes your way do as much as you can make the very most of it and ultimately when you graduate you should have absolutely no regrets and no missed opportunities all right see you in a few days life trip love you Thursday night. all right yeah see ya have fun i'll say hi to eric for you all right all right i'm on the plane now with my boy eric he just graduated college too right Absolutely. Yep. Go off to university, going to Kansas City soon, but today I'm going to Atlanta to tour six apartments and 
I'm bringing him with me. So it should be an awesome time. So starting next week's video, it's gonna pick up right where this one leaves off in Atlanta. So I'll see you there. to Atlanta so next video will pick up right here when I take you guys to tour a couple apartments with me and Eric there so I hope you enjoyed this video if you did make sure you drop me a thumbs up click subscribe if you haven't and I'll see you next Monday here from Atlanta <laughs>